A colleague of the trainee doctor who was raped and murdered in Calcutta says the gruesome crime has left her mentally traumatized and scared to go to work. Reuters has blurred her face and distorted her voice to protect her identity. She says she used to meet with the 31-year-old victim often. Just meet every day, we just talked about work and at least we talked and suddenly an unexpected situation. The victim had settled down for a rest in the college lecture hall after working nearly 20 hours of her 36-hour shift, staff told Reuters. The colleague says she has not been able to sleep since the August 9th attack. I don't know how the time's passed. Sometimes sleep comes, sometimes not. She says there's an atmosphere of fear in the absence of any concrete reassurances from authorities regarding their safety and security. Nine to ten days have been and nothing. Till now, there is nothing. Like for us, we can say that we all, the female residents especially, we are just scared to enter the department because if the security is same like the before, then anyone can be attacked. The attack has sparked a wave of protests and doctors across the country have declined to see non-emergency patients. A police volunteer has been arrested and charged with the crime. The government has urged doctors to return to duty while it sets up a committee to suggest measures to improve protection for healthcare professionals.